WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, good afternoon, folks. Larry Pesavento with the mid-morning update, and we are looking at a market that is up on the day. And also, if we look at the price of uh, gold, is actually up a little bit. But the big news is, folks, the Treasury bonds are finally starting to move higher a little bit. We'll cover that a little bit later. But I posted the chart here. Now, uh, those of you that are in the Tiger Den, you'll see that we've made a major 61% retracement in the E-mini S&P on Friday at 39.48. Uh, the low was 39.47.75, and we've rallied uh, 70 handles uh, off that bottom to meet meet the top up there at 40.20. We backed off a little bit, but we're still up on the day, uh, just chopping around. I just heard from uh, Shane Smolian to alert me that there's been a geomagnetic storm. One of the things that the Federal Reserve watches closely, uh, and that should put a tiny bit of pressure, uh, he thinks, for the next day or two uh, on the S&P. Uh, but we'll find out whether that uh, – Shane will be our guest uh, on Thursday uh, as our guest for Thursday. Uh, on Wednesday, we're going to have Mike Moore of Moore Analytics because he has really nailed this crude oil market. Uh, really nicely, so we want to be watching him, uh, what he has looking forward to us, because crude oil was up sharply during the day and then is sold off uh, towards the end of the day. So we're getting a lot of volatility, which we've been expecting for quite some time. But uh, those of you that do follow the Treasury bond market, make sure that you look at that Treasury bond market, folks, because we hit the exact price at 123.14 last night around 2 o'clock in the morning, Tucson time. That would have been 4 o'clock New York time, and since that time, it's rallied uh, well over $1,200. So that tells you that should be an important spot, being an exact 61% retracement of the low that we made you know, from the very beginning. So remind ourselves, folks, it's not how much money you make, it's how much money you don't lose. That's the real key. A focus on how much you have to risk, and you're going to be doing just fine in these markets. But boy, if you're not using a stop, folks, you're using one of the greatest uh, insurance policies that you can possibly get. It's an insurance policy against your failure, and you're going to fail a lot, but you're also going to be right a lot. We'll be right back. 877-927-6648. <laughs> 